Right, in this video we're just going to work out 684 times 479. Going to use two methods. First of all, we're going to use what's known as the Gelosia method. So in this method you do the following. You write down the number 684, the first number. And then down here you write down 479. Making sure you keep each thing in the squares nicely. Draw a square around them. Draw that line in and that line and then draw in the grids that way. So you've sort of got a grid. Now across the grid, you now need to draw lines across the diagonal, like this. Okay, now in order to do this, all you do now is you do six times four, and you write down, that's 24, so you write 24. Eight times four, which is 32, so three and a two. And then 4 times 4, which is 16. And now you do 6 times 7, which gives you 4 and a 2. 8 times 7, which is 56. And then 4 times 7, which is 28. Continuing on, you do 6 times 9, which is 54. 8 times 9, which is 72. And then 4 times 9, which is 36. Right, now what you do is you do the addition, but you do the addition along this way. So the first one's just going to be 6. The next one's going to be 8 plus 3 plus 2, which is 13. So you write a 3 here, and you carry the 1 over here. The next one's going to be 6 plus 2 plus 6 plus 7 plus 4 plus 1, which makes 26. So you put a 6 here, and then a 2 here, and then you do... 1 plus 2 plus 5 plus 2 plus 5 and a 2 which makes 17 so 7 carry 1 and then you do 3 plus 4 plus 4 which is plus 1 which is 12 so it's 2 carrying 1 and 1 plus 2 is 3 and therefore you can say that 6 8 4 times 4 7 9 is going to be 3 2 7 six three six in that order so that is uh three hundred and twenty seven thousand six hundred and thirty six and this is called the gelosia method now the more traditional method is you write down six eight four and then 4, 7, 9, and then a time sign, and then you do your multiplication. So you do 4 times 9, which is 36, so 6 carry the 3. 9 times 8, which is uh, 9 times 8, which is 72, but you need to add in the 3, so that now makes that 5, so it's 75, so it's 5 carry the 7. And then 6 times 9, which is 54, but you need to add in the And you need to add in the 7, so uh, 54 plus 7 makes uh, 61. Now what you do is you put in a 0 here, and you now do 7 times 4, which is 28. 7 times, six, uh, seven times 8, which is uh, 56 plus the 2, which makes 58. 6 times 7... So it's 40, 42 plus the 5, which now makes 47. You now put in two zeros. And you do 7 times 4, which is... Sorry, I beg your pardon. You now do 4 times 4, which is 6, carry the 1. 4 times 8, which is 32, so that now becomes 33. 3, carry the 3. And 4 times 6, which now becomes... Uh, 24 plus the 3 which makes 27 draw in a line and we now need to add those up so this will become 6 5 plus 8 will become 13 so that's 3 carry the 1 1 plus 8 plus 6 plus 1 will become 1 plus 8 is 9 plus uh 6 is 15 plus 1, so it becomes 6, carry 1, 16. 6 plus 7 is 13, 
plus 3 is 16 plus 3 1 is 17 now 4 plus 7 is 11 plus the 1 which is 12 so it's 2 carrying the 1 and 2 plus 1 which is 3 so we've got the same answer 327,636 so this has been a video to show you how to work out a free figured uh, multiplication by using the Gelosi method or the traditional method uh, I hope you've understood and I thank you very much for watching.